So Cody users, how are we all doing? It's been a while, so I'm going to show you. Guess what? We've got a version of Cody 22. Cody 22, you can install on your Fire Stick. I'm going to show you how to do it. You can do it on your Fire Stick, Fire TV. You can actually do it on any Android device or your Android TVs. But obviously, Fire TVs is our forte here. Fire Sticks and Android TV we cover. So we're going to show you how to get it installed. Um, this is Cody 22. Let me see if you can guess the name they've called it. They always have a certain name for them. And I will show you it as we load it up at the end. But first, I'm going to show you how to install it. Before we do that, though, if you can, make sure you hit that follow button. Subscribe. It's free. You can do that as you go. And make sure you've got your VPN running for your privacy and security. We will go into a bit more of that right at the end. So first things we need to do is get this downloader app. If you've already got the downloader app, you can probably skip on about 30 seconds, 45 seconds to where I show you how to get the rest. But if you haven't got it yet, what you need to do is go to your magnifying glass, type in here, easily done, downloader, D-O-W, you'll see downloader pop up. You click that, make sure you get the correct one, which looks exactly the same as mine for now. We've got a new feature coming soon, which will hopefully stop needing the use of this, but we'll go into that in a future video. Click that, get it downloaded, but don't open it yet. Next up, you're going to have to go back to your home screen, then across to settings. From settings, go to My Fire TV, and you can go to Developer Options. If you do not have Developer Options, you click on where it says About, and you click the top option seven times, so when you go back, you will have Developer Options. Yay! Click Open on your Developer Options, you turn ADB Debugging on, and Install Unknown Apps, you turn it on for that Downloader app. Get that turned on. That means it can download the apps from a third-party source, which will be my website. Yay. Right, that's now your device set up to install apps from a third party, so in the future you can do it every time. Now, magnifying glass, we don't need that. We're going to go across to our downloader app. If you don't see it on your screen, three squares and the plus, my apps, and it'd be with all your other apps, okay? So you'll find it in here, probably at the bottom if you've just installed it. Click on it, and then what you're going to do is you're going to type in my code, okay? So my code is 75726. This will go to my downloader page. Um, while that's loading, gives you a perfect chance to hit that follow button, drop any questions or thoughts, and drop those comments on whether you know what the new Kodi is called. And then you can scroll down and at the top, you will see under new updates and new APKs, Kodi 22. If you do not see it there and you're watching this video at a later date, keep scrolling. And it will also be under here under media players, okay? Um, you may, by the time you're watching this, it may be a better layout because I'm going to tweak this because it's getting a little bit hard to navigate as things are changing. So we hit Kodi 22. If an ad pops up, we hit close. And what that will do is download the latest Kodi 2022 page, 2022, Kodi 22 page. Thankfully, I've made the download button nice and big, you can't miss. So you click it, and that will download for you. Perfect. You can then click install. You can click uh, done. And then you can click delete because we don't need that file anymore. That's done. It's all installed. Remember, though, if you are installing it, um, it is a pre-release version of Kodi 2022 or <laughs> Kodi 2022 of Kodi 22. So it will overwrite what you've already got. So be wary of that before you do it. And we are not showing you how to get free movies or TV shows on this video. We are just showing you how to get the media player, which is Kodi, which is available on the Amazon App Store and many other stores, including my own. So it's a perfect app. It's just a media player. So to open your Kodi 22, it will be in front of you on the screen or again in the free squares and the plus. Go to my apps. And then if it's at the bottom for you, mine's at the top and we can load it up and you will get the splash screen. And what's it called? Kodi 22. Wait for it. Peers, peers, Kodi 22 peers alpha. What a strange one. Let's see if we can find the actual name in there. P-I-E-R-S. 
Um, it should be on system information. Has it got it written on there? 22 alpha 1, but it was peers. P-I-E-R-S. Who would have thought, eh? And that is it. And then you can do everything you want with it. There's a few different tweaks and updates, but there's the latest version for you. Get ahead of the game if you want it. Like we said earlier, if you do want your VPN, um, we have one linked for you here underneath. I'm going to show you in a second. These are my two channels, Doc Squiffy, you're watching now. Doc Squiffy, quick tips if you want some of these videos fast, punchy, in about two minutes. And one of my websites, new ones I'm developing below for sports predictions. But that VPN is here. If you want it, it is all here for you. I might as well leave my head in the middle, it doesn't really matter. It's all here for you. Um, great offer, great discount, linked underneath. Keep you safe online, stop your ISP throttling your speeds. Helps you access different content around the world, whether it's on different Netflixes, different streaming apps, due to geolocations. Your VPN can help you out. Brilliant. So, I have been Doc Squiffy. Thank you all for watching. Let me get rid of that. Remember to hit those follow buttons. Let me know of the install and how it goes. And I'll see you on the next one.